Hey. Look at Mountain Blade, man. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. I just want you to look at my breasts. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Pop, pop <laughs> that chest. Gotta pop that. Gotta pop that. Hi, welcome. I don't know why I'm like, hey, as if I'm not in the shot. I'm Hello. Gonna... Did you put all the stuff on? Oh, you did. Usually he asks me to to put all the stuff on. You don't even have the tree on half the time. No. That's because it's too cozy in this room. Sorry, I'm just turning things off on my other screen. I always look over here. I'm like, oh, hello. 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 Hi, Susie. How, how are you getting on? <laughs> I know your face is like plastered in makeup today. We don't talk about that. It's fine. I forgot to put moisturizer on, so it was like doing a, what's like a workman's paste that dries really quickly? <laughs> it's almost like you were plastering. Ah, <laughs> see, <laughs> I... I've just plastered it on. What's the name for that stuff that you put on walls, <laughs> it's pink? <laughs> that you plastered on your face? Yeah, well, I wonder. <laughs> Okay, well now I feel really silly. <laughs> it is Christmas jumper o'clock. Where's yours? I don't have it. It's in the cupboard. It's in the walk-in wardrobe, darling. I offered to get him one from Marks and Spencer the other day because the only one you own, which was sent to us in the P.O. box, which is in the description, was quite Halloween-ish. We bet. Why? Because it's got skull and crossbones. It doesn't really give the it's, whole Christmas It's a spirit. pirate's Christmas jumper. Yar. Yar. Yar is a pirate's Christmas jumper. Are you going to tell them your new voice acting job that you have got lately? Oh, for Nino Cooney. Yeah. So he's playing Nino Cooney and he decided to give them all an accent and to voice the full thing when I'm just lying in bed. It's great for me. It's like free content. <laughs> <laughs> It sounded like you were being so sarcastic there. No, I think you do a really good job. I think it's crazy that you actually remember the voices. The voices for each of them. Because yeah. like Esther sounds like a young girl and Oliver sounds like a young boy. And it, it it's quite a difficult one too. And then Swain's like a depressed Londoner. Yeah, which is pretty good. And then you've got the, the lady that runs the milk shop in the real world who is a broad Scottish guy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, darling. <laughs> this is the kind of thing that like people would be like, why can't I see this? You know, like well, they'd watch it. <laughs> oh, they would. A hundred percent they would. Anyways, regardless, welcome back to another movie night, Harry Potter and the What's he doing in this one? Order of the Phoenix. Oh. <laughs> it's a Phoenix. The dying phoenix. That's my phoenix. Well, yeah, and then they're reborn from the ashes, and they go... What that? Spoilers. That's what's going to happen in the movie, is it? We literally it? just seen it in the last movie. Yeah, duh. Wait, no. It's like you weren't paying attention. No, the Chamber of Secrets. The last The last movie wasn't the Chamber of Secrets. That was the, the one with the cup. You make it sound the like... The Tri-Wizards it. Tournament! The Quad Wizards qu qu Tournament. I can't believe that Batman died. I, you oh, know well, what? I deserved it. We're not going to talk about other shows, but I'm sick and tired of Batman dying. And not even Batman from his own show. We like to call Batman... I'm trying to think. Did Batman die in his own show? I don't know what happened. Or did he just bug it off to Scotland or Because so? they took that long. We can't even discuss this. <clears throat> he took that long... For us to watch that show, that I couldn't tell you a bloody thing about it. I mean, he's barely in it. Almost it's like not really a Batman Thomas. show. A little bit. What do you want? Hey! Aww, took too long an intro, now this idiot's coming in to poo. <laughs> what are you doing, Finny? What are you doing, Finny? What are you doing? Hello, Finny. Yep, yep, we're, yep, family time. Yeah, you alright? You want to go under there? No, he's just inspecting the place now. He's inspecting if it's good enough for me to be in here. Or if he wants... No, we're not doing it. We're not talking about the dog's <laughs> <laughs> bowel issue. We're here with more Game of Thrones. It's still Christmas. It's definitely not Game of Thrones, though. <laughs> <laughs> Cut. We should have finished Game of Thrones by now. By the time this goes up. So you going to the bedroom? Finny. What are you doing, you numpty? Go and lie down. Can't get the staff these days. That's it. I gave him a little piece of meat and now we should be good. I told you not to. <laughs> and we are back with more Harry Potter. <laughs> so, what number is this now then? Five? Oh, I don't know. Ah, something one? like that. Aye. 
We've been really busy this Christmas. This Christmas has actually been a lot of fun. Usually, we will just kind of do all these videos, work, 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 and then Christmas Day comes, eat a ton of food, and then go back, back to, work. to work. But I feel like this year, I'm kind of like forcing us to be like, we're going to do that. We're going to vlog this. We're going to go there. And, we're, and it's kind of nice. I got the networking done in the house. Yeah. Well, half of it. What that means is there's no more cables that are a dye hazard throughout the house. A there. dye hazard. Well, the, and also the dog hair was like wrapping up around it as well. Don't tell Phipps. <laughs> <laughs> He's the way he doesn't clean the house. You wouldn't know. Don't tell Phipps. Why are you rolling up your sleeves? Because <laughs> I'm getting ready to attack. Oh, yeah. If you want to watch this unedited with us, <laughs> make sure you head on over to the Patreon. It's in the description. Or head on over to the website, suzylou.co.uk. I'm kind of bored of saying that there will be an update. There'll be an update at some point to the website. Well, that's what I was going to say. Oh. Yeah, all the stuff that we've been doing has meant that you says to me, oh, it better be here before Christmas. I mean, oh, just seeming like I'm... No. I was working on it today. I some new stuff done today on it. It's looking good, though. It is looking good. You're getting there. It's and looking then good. Then I drag you out of the house. It'll look very similar to the last website. They'll never know. Except, they'll, well, they will, because it's a lot better. <laughs> but, better for me, too. Yeah, better on all fronts. But I'm dragging this guy out and about, and we vlogged a lot of it as well. So if you want to see those vlogs, I can leave links in the description of the videos, because I think Christmas stuff's interesting for people. Yeah. I love watching Christmas vlogs. I'm behind the camera most of the time. And then when he's in the camera, he's making a stupid face. Right, anyway. <laughs> it's just my normal I face. I asked him the other day, I was like, are you happy leaving the house with me? Like, are you happy <laughs> doing these things? No, I'm it's like, I'm like, yeah, having a good time. And then it pans to him and he's like. <sighs> yeah, it's funny. I don't know if he's doing it because he's like bored though. Like, do you actually want to, like, leave the house, or would you rather just stay in here? Well, I might leaving the house. Just leaving the house with you is a bit of an issue, but, you know, I do what I do, because I have to. Why is it an issue? <laughs> oh, shit, I'm kidding. But I don't know if he's kidding anymore. I'm only kidding. I don't know if he put, he trapped me, okay? And I was being nasty. And <laughs> you can't leave now. <laughs> I'm out in front of me. I can leave whenever I want to leave, and I'll take all five Christmas trees with me. <laughs> you can, yeah. There you go. <laughs> And the attic will be clear. No, because you'd have to leave the house. Right, anyway, <laughs> let's... <laughs> I'll keep in the house. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> right, let's not have a divorce, divorce live on camera. And let's delve on in to the next Harry Potter movie. Why Why did you choke on delve? Because you don't like it when I say delve. Oh, I don't like a lot of things. I don't like a lot of things. I don't think you like me, to be oh, honest. Put up with you. We've only been married six months and already you're putting up with me nah love you well, i love you too <laughs> you actually said to me the other day all i wanted to do is watch harry potter yeah and here i am <laughs> and the order of the phoenix we didn't talk about anything that's not a phoenix that's a phoenix the last movie was really intense that was good a bit of change of change of uh tone i was complaining a lot about it felt like the movies had this like script of how they were going to go. Yeah, super formulaic. And then the last one just kind of started that way and then it just changed completely. And then that like, I give you a wand against uh, Voldemort. I give you to... <laughs> that was intense. It wasn't intense. It was in the graveyard. Okay, but then it was like, Robert, <laughs> when he died, I don't know if I explained this, but... I kind of knew he was going to die, but only because I'm watching this after the fact. I'm like, he's too big for this show. But he wasn't. Not at the time. Life is like an empty roundabout. <laughs> hey, Big D. Beat up another ten-year-old. Big D, that's what, that's what my mates call me. Because I've got a big D. Moaning in your sleep every night. At least I'm not afraid of my pillow. <laughs> <laughs> Where is your mum? Where is your mum, Potter? I mean, your cousin literally saw someone get get murdered in front 
front of him. Multiple times. <laughs> 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 Don't laugh, man. He could do a lot with his wand. I suppose he shouldn't really be kicking about with that and just poke it. You're not allowed to use magic. It's not Dudley, it's Big D, alright? What are you doing? I'm not doing anything! Get out of here, Dudley! Come on, Dudley! He's actually cleaning the entire park. <laughs> People drop a lot of newspapers there. They do drop a lot of newspapers. That's a lot of newspapers! I mean, this is just Scotland. We don't run from it. We embrace yeah, it. Yeah, that is just Scotland. One minute, bright, sunny day. <laughs> no clouds in the sky. Next minute, pushing it down. Five minutes later, snowing. <laughs> he looks a bit like Hodor. I can kind of see it. He's a fat kid. No. <laughs> he has the same eyes. He's not fat, he's just big bones. Oh my god, that was terrifying. What the hell is that? Dementor? Because it's meant icy. Oh! <laughs> I told you, see! See! Snow! I thought that it, it looks like a Dementor, but I thought they had like cloaks on. Oh, it definitely is. Yeah. Oh, that gives me the heebies. Listen, I dream about jelly beans and internet drama. I'm glad I don't dream about that. I don't think he's dreaming. Get nailed. Right, you need to nail the other one that's killing Dudley. Ah, nah, screw Dudley. He's a bit of a nasty one, isn't he? He is, but, you know... Come on, die! Maybe he'll be kind to you now. People will start asking questions if you let your cousin die in front of you. <clears throat> Needs chocolate. Don't put away your wand, Harry. They might come back. It's just, it's just in his pocket. After you know who... Killed that poor diggory boy last year. Did you expect him to let you go wandering around on your own? So a whole year has passed though. Well, no, I reckon this is just the end of the summer. I can't tell. Obviously, he's trying to pretend he's holding he's up like his cousin. Him, yeah. But like, it just looked like he was just kind of strangling him a little bit. I was about to say the same thing, like, had him in a headlock. <laughs> <clears throat> Here he comes. Is that you? Can confirm it wasn't a dream. Who did this to you, boy? He just needs some sugar. <laughs> oh, pucker off! Tell the truth! You've finally done it. You've finally driven him loopy. About time. What, just, just look at him, Petunia. Our boy has gone yumpy. That's what he always looks like, though. Oh. Earl's here. Oh! Oh, must be Earl. <laughs> Jesus, look like it died. He's fine. Mr. Potter. Oh God. You performed the Patronus charm in the presence of a muggle. I was only his cousin. For the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery, you are hereby expelled. Excuse me, did they not ask questions? Well, Mathelda Hopkirk. Yeah, we'll see about that, Mathelda. Justice. Oh, so, like such justice. You do realise that it means he'd have to spend more time with you. Yeah, but he thinks that, like, he obviously doesn't know what a Patronus charm is. He thinks that he's just done it to Dudley. It's not the wall's fault, Dobby. Oh, he's broke his photo frame. Sorry, Hedwig. <laughs> Poor owl. That's a shame. That's not one photo that you want to accidentally break. Oh, it's just a frame. Yeah, but they move around and it's adorable. They cut their hands on it. I bet he wishes he was dreaming now. Oh, uh, well, that was his, like... That's the third person he's seen die in front of him, second. Third, if you count Tom Riddle, when he stabbed the book. I think you forget, because the Harry Potter movies, he started off quite like, I'm a wizard, Harry. You're a wizard. And then now... It seems like it might kind of touch on his mental health a little bit. Like he's not okay and you wouldn't expect him to be. No. Expelliarmus! See if you were expelled though, would they just like shut your wand off? <laughs> <laughs> no, they can't do that. I these muggles. Tonks for God's sake. Oh, hello. <laughs> Professor Moody. 
actual professor. I thought they the real one this time. Not here, Nymphadora. Don't call me Nymphadora. Oh, she turned Scottish. If you know. <laughs> <laughs> what is she in that we've watched? I don't know, but I, I know who she her. is. Yes, if one of us is killed. Oh, Nosy Parker across the way. She's the one that was looking at uh, the, the Dumbledore. So she's still a Nosy Parker across that's the way. That's her job. Well. And no, that's not your job. I don't have any neighbours. I can't peek. You would if you could. Oh, I would. There's not very stealthy flying through they the Thames. They can't see them. I bet they can't. <laughs> <laughs> How beautiful is that, though? How beautiful is that, though? <laughs> <laughs> if anyone's seen them, they would just think it's Halloween. I feel like that's the same road that we stayed on when we went to um, Capcom. It looks like it. Looks just it? like it, yeah. London is beautiful. If you ever get the chance to go, it really is. It's just busy. Oh, well, very busy. Oh no, that was where we stayed. I, I, I distinctly remember it expanding like that. Ah, yeah, yeah. We had the middle one. Yeah. Magic. In you go, son. Again, I just want to say, I'm surprised that he would be allowed to leave Hogwarts and then just go back to his family, given everything that's happened. I don't know what else you expect them to do. Look after him! Well, they are, look! After something happened. Alright. <laughs> Keep it in your pants. Looking stronger and stronger by the minute. We have to act now. Oh, hello. Harry. Mrs. Weasley. They could do a plaster there. I'll get my dad on the case. <laughs> but I'm afraid dinner will have to wait until after the meeting's finished. Uh, no. Uh, no time to explain. Straight upstairs, first door on the left. Why can't he go into the meeting though? He's a child! <sighs> Barely. He ages like five years each movie. Let him to her house. What would she say to him? Well, look who it oh, is. Oh, it's not Dobby. That's not Dobby. He's got different eyes. Like we all did. He's cool with the, the your kind though. Don't be giving him evils. Creature is here. You're saying something about like scum that they let into the house. You must tell us everything. Let the man breathe a moment. And this hearing at the ministry. It's just outrageous. I got attacked by a dementor. His headquarters. Of the Order of the Phoenix. It's a secret society. Dumbledore formed it back when they first fought you know who. So I'll blow a secret then, is it? I like that they still call him you-know-who. Like, he's back, you might as well say his name. Voldemort. <laughs> That's not his name. <laughs> well then they can't get scared of it, can they? No, I'm the one who fought him, I'm the one who saw Cedric Diggory get killed. Harry. Jesus. Can we not do that, thank you? Anyway, if you're all done shouting, do you want to hear something a little more interesting? Oh. Are they actually twins? Yes. Okay, I just, I never know if they like, superimposed the other one. <laughs> He's not James, Harry. He's not your son. He's as good as. Aww. Untouchingly paternal black. Perhaps Potter will grow up to be a felon, Snake. just like his godfather. Yeah. Don't eat the ear, Mr. Kitty. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, just because you're allowed to <laughs> That's a life advice. Boys. <laughs> Serious. <laughs> I don't know why you're so happy to see him. Why? Why wouldn't the you Weasleys? Be? The Weasleys are, have been really nice to him, and they're like. Fudge is using all his power to smear anyone who claims the Dark Lord has returned. Why? But why? Yeah. Fudge isn't in his right mind. He's been twisted and warped by fear. He's heartbroken. Ah, we need to fix that. And I'm afraid the minister will do almost anything to avoid facing that terrifying trip. Well, then he needs to get a ball sack, okay? He sounds like he's scared. Just a sack. Not the balls, just a sack. <laughs> just a sack. He's been recruiting heavily, and we've been attempting to do the same. 
But gathering followers isn't the only thing he's interested in. Is it gathered in magical items? Voldemort may be after something. Serious. Oh, come on, get to it. Something he didn't have last time. The face? No, that's enough. He's just a boy. He's just a boy that defeated him twice. I don't think he defeated him. He sort of ran away. <laughs> he sort of brought him back. Well. As the guy said, he'll find out the info anyway. Yeah. So you might as well tell him. Might as well induct him into the, the Hall of Phoenix. Like, I'd be pure raging if I'm sitting there and someone's like, don't tell him. <laughs> it's your mum. Careful. <laughs> I'm not even going to get into the story of my mum on an escalator, but it's hilarious. <laughs> this was literally my mum in Glasgow! Magic. I like to walk back, though. Sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. My mum was terrified to get on an escalator, so she held up the entire escalator and then didn't move when she was on it. Again, holding up the entire escalator. And it was hilarious. Remember telephone boxes? Yeah, and then they replaced them with those horrible see-through BT ones. Still get some of them, the red ones. The only time I used one, I had to like charge back the call because I had no money and my dad was raging. <laughs> oh, 800 reverse. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you don't mess with them. You end up going diagonally. Just wait and see when Voldemort da decides to <laughs> Voldemort come out. If he decides to come out and show his face, then you'll be sorry. Then you'll realize. Yeah, because you get to look at his face. Yeah. He should get a new one. Morning, Arthur. Morning, Bob. Oh Jesus! What the hell? Interdepartmental memos. We used to use owls. This was unbelievable. <laughs> I'll just use email. It changed the time of your hearing. When is it? In five minutes. Your elevator's gone the wrong way, mate. <laughs> Department of Mysteries. Imagine there was no Hogwarts in this movie. Because he's not allowed back. Oh, look who it is! He's a Death Eater. He has amazing hair. We know you're a Death Eater. His style's not bad either. Imagine hearing speak only when you're spoken to. He's not got a lawyer? As the muggles say, truth will out. Yes? <laughs> I think he's a wizard lawyer. Good luck, Harry. Good luck, Harry. He didn't have a, a stubble on his face in the last movie, and now you can see he's grown. Albus Percival Wolfric Brian Dumbledore. Damn! I must have missed it, but by a happy mistake, I arrived at the Ministry three hours early. <laughs> I knew what you were going to do. Uh, you were aware that you were forbidden to use magic outside school while under the age of 17? Yes. I mean, there's context, though, and you're kind of missing it. Yeah. Like, this isn't how law works. A little bit too. Yeah. That's quite clever. Where's the old lady? Since you can produce no witnesses of the event... Well then, if there's no witnesses, how do you know that it's true? There you go, old lady. What did they look like? One of them was very large, the other rather skinny. Not the boys, the Dementors. Be more precise with your speech. Everything went cold, as though all the happiness had gone from the world. Now look here. You're not supposed to laugh, though, at a witness. You're supposed to be the judge. Dementors are, after all, under the control of the Ministry of Magic. Are they, though? Why the two Dementors were so very far from Azkaban, and why they mounted an attack without authorization. Exactly, he was only defending there himself. Who might be behind the attack. It doesn't exist. Where? <laughs> The evidence that the Dark Lord has returned is incontrovertible. Look at him, he's gonna explode! Then who killed Cedric? Cedric, Cedric. Magic may be used before muggles in life-threatening situations. Laws can be changed if necessary. Why would you change but laws? But that's what happened though! A criminal trial to deal with a simple matter of underage magic. It's a witch hunt. Yeah, 
accusation You look like the Spanish spirit. Inquisition. Nobody expects Those that. in favour of conviction. Oh, God, this is going to go well. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, oh. Don't look at... You're not allowed to look at the... Those what? in favour of clearing the accused of all charges. See? Spanish Inquisition agrees. Hey, you put your hand up as well. Why not? Be I counted. think we win. Ha St ha. Stand up and be counted. Cleared of all charges. Oh, boo! Oh. Boo hoo! <laughs> Crying for Good you! For you. <laughs> Good for you! Listen, there'll be time to thank him later. There's kind of a bigger problem than you. But at least you're not going to jail. Doggy. That's an Irish wolfhound. And that's an owl behind him. Where'd your clothes come from? Nobody knows. Anyway, I wanted you to have this. You could give him a back of the house. That's exactly the kind of dog I would expect him to yeah. be. Original Lord of the Phoenix, Marlene McKinnon. Oh, Hagrid. It's been 14 years. And still a day doesn't go by I don't miss your dad. What a shame. You know, I don't know if I could deal with photos being like that. Yeah, that'd be brutal. That would kill me. You keep it. Anyway, I suppose you're the young ones now. He's not allowed to almost bring on waterworks this early. It's really sad though that Neville lost his parents as well. Oh God, you're, you're just seeing things. He's not really there. It's just Agent 47 coming to kill you. There's no way he'd actually be there. Everyone would be staring at his face. No. Everyone knows what it looks like. Such a weird design for a character, though. Mm. Probably reasons behind it, though. Yeah, there must be. Oh, he sacrificed his nose so that he could get 5% more magical energy. Then why is his storyteller always, always a pirate? pirate. <laughs> <laughs> and we still need to go to... The train section. The train section. For one of these videos. The Glenfinnan Viaduct. Yeah. I'm surprised the can. ministry hasn't shoved Fight the wand up your dad's. Azkaban with your name on it. Oh, get aggressive. What do I tell you? Complete nutter. Just stay away from me. What do you mean complete nutter? You were being a dick and he went to smack you on. Ron, you didn't need to do that. Just let him. Like, it's going to happen. Some people, we've talked about this, deserve a good punch. I mean, he already got a good punch. From a lady. Oh, there's a Scottish lady. Oh, that lady. Hi, Harry. That's gonna be like, give her the accent, but don't, <laughs> don't ruin it. You're right, Harry. <laughs> Look mighty fine in your glasses there. I love that scar that brings out your eyes. Oh, a chocobo. What is it? The pony, mate. Nothing's pulling the carriage, Harry. It's pulling itself, like always. What happens if other people walk into this invisible pony? Why is he able to see it? I can see them too. You're also reading the book upside down. You're just as sane as I am. It's not very comforting, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone, this is Luna Love... Luna Lovegood. What? Why is she freaking out by introducing her? I don't I know, get it. I neither. Is she ashamed that she knows her, maybe? I don't know. That was a weird scene. I think the weirdest thing's Neville's undulating cactus. That looks great. Oh, Jesus. I'm going back to Hogwarts to get some cake. Someone's been to Costco. Oh, man. There's <laughs> all the profiteroles on, on top the, of the cake. cake. I know. It looks so good. Oh, I'm hungry. I'm still on a diet. We'll be taking care of magical creatures while Professor Hagrid is on temporary leave. Wait, what? Why? What? Our new defense against the dark oh, arts God. teacher, Professor what? Dolores Umbridge. <laughs> yep. How did she get the job? Now, as usual, our caretaker, Mr. Sorry, Schultz, I'll only be for this movie. You. You're going to shut up? I'm giving my speech. No, I think she's making her own speech. She works for Fudge. Thank you, Headmaster, for those kind words of welcome. And it was meant to stop there. <laughs> I'm sure we're all going to be very good friends. I'm sure you aren't. Although each headmaster has brought something new to this historic school. 
They've all left. <laughs> preserve what must be preserved. Perfect what can be perfected. She's terrifying in such a middle manager sort of way, isn't she? So she's going to give you some, like, corporate jargon in a second. And then fire you with that smile on her face. We need to work on synergy. It means the ministry's interfering at home. Hmm, I wonder why. Or oh, the government intervention. Plotter. God, Harry just has it rough constantly. I know. Why is the newspaper is doing a smear on him? Campaign not test. The Daily Prophet's been saying a lot of things about you, Harry, and about Dumbledore as well. What, and your mum believes them? Well, nobody was there the night Cedric died. Okay, so you can't just believe it then. Don't you dare talk about my mother like I'll that. I'll never go anyone that calls me a liar. What's going on? He's mad as what's going on. Yeah, I'd be mad too. Has anyone else got a problem with Harry? <laughs> yeah, bring it on. Knock it out. Damn, Ron! In the corner there, like the bezer should be. Like that. Good leprechauns. Seamus was bang out of order, mate. But he'll come through. We'll see. I said I'm fine, Ron. Uh, you, you don't sound fine. Also, don't have a go at him. He was the only one in your corner. I'll just leave you to your thoughts, then. I'll oh, just knock him out and hold on. <laughs> Swift right, <laughs> I'll cheer him up. <laughs> it's been a long summer, okay? Harry, you're getting too big for your boots. <laughs> Harry's starting to have freaking Wet dreams. Wet <laughs> dreams! I don't think I wet dreams when you sweat the bed out. That was quite scary though. You like you wake up from a nightmare and he's just staring at you. You be like, just a soulless wonder, like, just staring. At you. Like this isn't helping. Ah! This is bird abuse. What? You were saying? Good morning, children. At least she knows how to cast a spell, unlike the the blonde Ordinary guy. <laughs> wizarding level examination. I feel like I'm watching Matilda. More commonly known as. Chickens! Fail to do so, and the consequences may be severe. <clears throat> See, she's got that smile. Death! Ha ha ha! I'm gonna kill you all! The previous huh? instruction for this subject has been disturbingly uneven. Oh, yes. Using spells? <laughs> well, I can't imagine why you would need to use spells in my classroom. Oh, is it? Uh, uh, um. You will be learning about defensive spells in a secure, risk-free way. Oh my god, what is this 2023? It won't be risk-free. Students will raise their hands when they speak in my class. You're wrong! What use, what use is that? <laughs> I thought <laughs> Will be sufficient to get you through your examinations, which after all, is what school is all about. This is like physical education, but you don't get to play rounders. Yeah. Who do you imagine wants to attack children like yourself? Oh, I don't know. Maybe Lord Voldemort. Oh God, you can't say his oh, name. No, oh, no, he's Oh no, he's talking about uh, the fairy, the tooth fairy. She just let one out. Now let me make this quite plain. Hen, there's been an attack at the school every year since Harry got here. Cedric Diggory's death was a tragic accident. It was murder. Voldemort killed him. You must know that. HR has spoken. Oh, no. Potter? My office. <laughs> did anyone brief her about this classroom or, or Harry? <laughs> or did how schools are supposed to work? That was a lot of sugar. She's a sweet lady. She's sweet enough. Have you ever had tea that size with that much sugar? I don't drink sugar in my tea, you know this. <laughs> Come in. Oh, she's a crazy cat lady! Oh, how did I not even realise? I love that she's pink washed the entire room. Oh, I kind of like it, and the doilies. Remember when I bought doilies and you were like, oh my god, 60. No, not with your quill. I'm going to be using a rather special one of mine. Is it a spikes? Is it like blade sword? It's like, yeah, you do that and it goes, Pew! ah! I must not tell lies. How many times? I feel like no. For as long as it takes for the message to sink in. All right, I'll just write it once. You haven't given me any ink. Oh, you won't need any ink. It's a magic quill. 
you're a wizard. Harry. I just went right your lines. I'd be like, no. I disagree with you entirely, hen. You're a pink hoe. You're a pink hoe. God, she is all about that forced positivity, eh? What the hell? Some tells me this isn't, you know. I didn't ask for a tattoo, I'm not even 18. This isn't sanctioned by the school. I mean, have you have you watched the other movies with the dark <laughs> arts teachers? Well, I'm not writing it again. If that's what it does. What do you mean? Yes, I've got a slice of my hand. Because you're a stupid pen. Nothing. That's right. Just stab in the eye with a pen. Because you know, deep down, you deserve to be punished. Yeah, I'm sorry. I had a complete mental breakdown. It's not even real. I'd be flinging her out the neatest window. I don't think Dumbledore could get him out of those two things she said. Stabbing in the eye and launching out the window. What? I just said she fell out the window. After she threw herself out of it. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm not asking you to write all of it for me. <laughs> He's happy with himself. You're honestly the most wonderful person I've ever met. If I'm ever rude to you again. Only I've gone back to normal. Oh, I'm still feeling a little bit of ooh there. What's wrong with your hand? Nothing. Your other hand. You've got to tell Dumbledore. No. Dumbledore's got enough on his mind right now. Anyway, I don't want to give Umbridge the satisfaction. I mean, she literally tortured you. torturing you. <laughs> the parents knew about this. Yeah, well, I haven't got any of those, have I, Ron? I was going to say, I don't think his uh, guardians would care much. What? They wouldn't. His godfather would, though. Well, he would, yeah. You don't understand. Um. Then help us too. Maybe you should rely on your friends a wee bit. Ah, if there's two people in the world, it's them who understand. Stijo here said that for Christmas we're gonna get an owl. I hope you're all right. Like it's it? starting to get colder here. This is where the thingy happened. The chicken. In spite of being back at Hogwarts, I feel more alone than ever. Because you're alienating your friends? Well, everyone else isn't being very nice. There you go, there's the hippogriff. Please save, you buddy! Fly and be free. Remember what his name was? Chicken. <laughs> oh, it's not a hippogriff. That's the things that was pulling the carriage. Oh! She has long shoes on. But she has beautiful hair. Only feet. Unfortunately, all my shoes have mysteriously disappeared. I suspect Nargles are behind it. It's always the Nargles. She is absolutely cute as a button. They're called Pestrels. Seems a bit crazy though. People avoid them because they're a bit... Scrawny looking. Different. Uh, just a bit different. I mean, they look like dinosaurs, and dinosaurs are cute. She did like to experiment, and one day one of her spells went badly wrong. Happens to the best of us. I do feel very sad about it sometimes. But I've got dad. See if your dad is the long blonde haired guy. Ho ho! <laughs> no, she's Luna Lovegood. Well, I suppose that's how he wants you to feel. No, cookies! <laughs> I'd want you to feel cut off from everyone else. Because if it's just you alone, you're not as much of a threat. This girl, man, she's a wizard. She's been reading the art of war. She just happens to have chunks of meat in her back. That's like Finny. You give him like a treat that's good for him and he's kind of like, all right. But you give him the biggest bit of chicken, knowing full well it'll make him ill. Did you ever stop Gone. Oh, I'm hungry. They're all the good sausages. She's having Cheerios. I am merely requesting that when it comes to my students, you conform to the prescribed disciplinary practices. Wait, how did she find out? Hermione. Minerva. Not at all, Dolores. <laughs> oh! But to question my practices is to question the ministry, and by extension, the minister himself. Oh, oh great, you're gonna get fired. I will not stand for is disloyalty. Disloyalty? What do you... what? Things at Hogwarts are far worse than I feared. 
Cornelius will want to take immediate action. Oh my god, this woman is an absolute whole bag. The High Inquisitor. What? Uh, things really are worse than we imagined. <laughs> That's for sure. To address the seriously falling standards at Hogwarts School. Why, because someone had to defend themselves on the outside? Well, I mean, if you were to look at it, a kid died and if they're saying that it wasn't Voldemort that done it... Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> he always gets attacked. She is just a buzzkill. I'd set fire to her. Wait, no music. All Weasley products banned. I mean, proper dress code. Okay, I can get behind that. Okay, this is major health and safety. Predict something for me. I'm sorry. I don't think that's how that works. This is, she's like the trunchbull. What are you? Bit rude. One teensy little prophecy. The grin. <laughs> One day we'll all die. You are in grave danger. <laughs> Harry Potter is going to kick you out of a window. I mean, she's not wrong. With the way she's behaving. Oh, beha yeah. Behaving. Behaving. She is in grave danger. It's Professor Chawani. She jumped out a window. We she's getting booted. Wait, that's not fair. But brutal. Because you put it on the spot like that. She was just having performance anxiety. But she's been at the school forever. 16 years. I'm... 16 years. Girl, you need to put a stop to her. She is wicked. She's a wicked witch. I was going to say, like, when's Dumbledore just going to fly kick her? Or do you think she's pushing for Dumbledore to resign? Professor McGonagall. I think she's got some kind of hold over him. You do not have, have the authority to banish him from the grounds. That power remains with the headmaster. Can you not just banish her from the grounds oh, then? No. <laughs> oh. But you all have studying to do. Professor. Good for you, man. Come out, assert the balls, and walk away. Don't even argue with her. Harry, I think he's got enough on his mind with her at the moment. I don't like you anymore, Harry. I mean, it's not Harry's fault, but this has all kind of happened because of Harry. <laughs> We're not learning how to pass our owls. She's taking over the entire school. Why are you not learning to pass your owls? What are you doing here? Answering your letter. You said you were worried about Umbridge. What's she doing? Oh, well, that's nowhere near as cool as the last time he done it. But Dumbledore is assembling his own forces to take on the Ministry. He's becoming more paranoid for the minute. That is paranoid. And all of this is going on while Voldemort's out there. I'm sorry, I can't be of more help. But for now, at least. It looks like you're on your own. You have to build your own Dumbledore's army with blackjack and hookers. Aw, oh, Sidious. You can't be serious. You can't be serious about all this. He really is out there, isn't he? Mm-hmm. Well, did you not believe him? We'll be able to defend ourselves. I think she did, but I, you know. And if Umbridge refuses to teach us how, we need someone who will. Why you look at Harry? You're say, better Harry? at teaching people! Yeah, you're the smart one. I'm sure you could whip out a Patronus charm if, if required. Harry! You're a wizard. Spooky. Spooky. Who would want to be taught by me? I'm a nutter, remember? Look on the bright side. You can't be any worse than old Toadface. Who's Toadface? Is that Umbridge? Jane Umbridge? He's supposed to be meeting us then. Just a couple of people. The entire class is in there, isn't it? Lovely spot. <laughs> Maybe not, just a goal. <laughs> that, that's such a cute goal! Teach the goal. Come back here. I know that voice. No, that was the, the man that owned the place. Oh, it sounded just like uh, Hagrid. Ah, they're all pirates. Hi. Well, see, there's a few. 
Because you know who's back here, Tosspot. So he says. So Dumbledore says. So Dumbledore says because he says. Why would you not listen to Dumbledore after all this time? Potter I don't get tell it. Tell us more about how Diggory got killed. Oh, you know yourself. As soon as the news cycle starts whipping people up into a frenzy. Is it true you can produce a Patronus charm? Yeah, biggin as well. Big stag. It's true. Third year, he fought with about 100 Dementors at once. He's kind of a badass, you know. A laser beamed, you know who, and we joined once. When you're a second away from being murdered, or watching a friend die right before your eyes, you don't know what that's like. You need to know that stuff, muscle memory, all right? Yeah, so they need trained, though, so that they don't be the ones that die. Exactly. If Cedric wasn't wasn't so much of a cocksure idiot, maybe he would have done something. Voldemort. She said it. He's really back. No, oh, just pulling your leg all this time. Oh yeah, I just love all the press. I'm kind of into that. Love getting cancelled on. God damn it, I couldn't, I couldn't get like a Twitter ex Harry Potter name quick enough. <laughs> Wait, why did Harry's name have to be on there? Surely that bit of paper's for everyone else. He no, was I get, like, I, that is people signing up to be part of the new Dumbledore army. It's an NDA. It's sort of exciting, isn't it? Breaking the rules. Who are you and what have you done with Hermione Granger? <laughs> I was gonna say. Cho couldn't take her eyes off you, could she? Oh. She's such a good wingman friend. See, some boys and girls can be just friends. You've got to make sure wherever it is, there's no chance to fight Oh god, man, she has ears all around. All student organizations are henceforth disbanded. Yeah, how dare you guys get together and talk? I know. The, the poor chess club. <laughs> Now what about mini golf? Is that gone too? What well, wizard's chess? Oh, fancy. Gotta say, if that appeared in front of me, I'd be like, I didn't see anything. You found the room of requirement. Wasn't it? The room of requirement. It's also known as the come and go room. Come and go room. It's where you take the prostitutes. <laughs> it's brilliant. It's like Hogwarts wants us to fight back. I didn't realize that Ronald was so short. Like compared to all of them. Oh, it's those two boys are actually very yeah, tall. Yeah, they're really tall. <laughs> oh. Swish and flick, mate. Come on, buddy. Please copy the approved text four times to ensure maximum retention. I love this. So she thinks that like, oh yes, we're all just typing and Wands away. But they've got their own little play place. <laughs> oh, you're not gonna tell. It's sort of a wizard's bread and butter, really. So um come on then, Nigel. Give me your best shot. She does kinda look at him a little some some. Go on, Nigel. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, and Nigel's in the fire. <laughs> Yay, Nigel! His wand is like half the size of him. <laughs> so just a block of cheese. That was me earlier. Come on, Come on girl, on. kick his ass. Come on, oh, you know she will. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, the intensity. <laughs> His face. Had a couple of bets on that one, eh? I let her do that. It's good man, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. <laughs> so I was gonna eat cheese. <laughs> I'm gonna fall asleep with it, like, still in your hand. Maybe she's really tired. Oh, I've got the map. Mm-hmm. Illicit activities, They'll submit I think to questioning. Yeah, I suspected illicit activities. Goodness me. Oh, I want a cup of Not tea. without oh. much sugar. Jinx, she's using that. She might use that stuff on them. You know, the truth serum. Better to serum. Great. A little higher. A little lower. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't 
think she was though. Oh, well, they left chocolates for them. That's so nice. Love you. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't eat anything that was just left out. Mm. Oh. Ah, disgusting! Yuck! Reminds me of the teenager days. <laughs> Oh great. Oh, yeah, of course, squad. yeah, of course they want to be a part of it. <laughs> Believing in yourself. <laughs> just, just killed a child. <laughs> if they can do it, why not us? Exactly. If Voldemort can be a student. Why would it show? Oh, okay. But even still, it's showing the door to them. And then it's going to be another location. Oh. Just a broom cupboard. Girl! Alright. And that's training done. You be careful with that wand. That's the sister, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Expelliarmus! Expelliarmus! <laughs> Expelliarmus! Stupefy! Expelliarmus! Oh. <laughs> he did it! Well done. Bless him, he's got no confidence in him. Make your mum and dad proud, Neville. Now, we're not going to be meeting again until after the holidays. Aww. And well done, everyone. Great, great work. Not allowed to do do magic outside of school. Harold. Well done, mate. Thanks. It's nice to see him smile again. I don't like people attacking Mr. Potter. They both like. Definitely won't like Voldemort. <clears throat> <then. clears throat> She's alone. See you in the common room, Harry. Got to shoot your shot, Harry. Merry Christmas, not at all. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone! Merry Christmas. Now I kind of understand why they're like, what are these Christmas movies? It's always snowy. There's always and... something to do with Christmas, isn't it? They give you these massive pus filled balls. Right, it sounds great, guys. Would you excuse me? Shirt in the shot, guys. I know, don't be a. a guys. A, a CB. Read the room. Aw, it's got him on the mirror. Anyway, it's, it's worth it. Like keep in your pants. He was really good. It's just Voldemort was better. What you would expect that the Dark Lord would be better than a student. Kiss. <laughs> Room of uh, requirements. Under the mistletoe. mistletoe. I think Batman gives his blessing. Oh. His first kiss. <laughs> Oh my god! Did you know he might have kissed his pillow or his hand or his mirror? No, this is the first proper kiss. I feel like I should be looking. Yay, Harry! Look at him going in there. That's, that's quite a bit of mistletoe. I don't got no mistletoe well, in my house. Was no. Wet. <laughs> I mean, she was sort of crying. What? Why was she crying? I'm sure Harry's kissing was more than satisfactory. <laughs> I don't think I've ever said that about a friend. I'm sure his kissing was satisfactory. Don't you understand how she must be feeling? Guys don't get girls' feelings. And therefore confused about liking Harry and guilty about kissing him. Conflict because I'm just threatening to sack her mum from her job at the ministry. And oh, or is that how you're feeling? So One what you're saying is she shouldn't have kissed him, explained. or? Ah, might as well. Just because you've got the emotional range of a teaspoon. She's not wrong. Tablespoon at least, come on. <laughs> it's alright Harry, no one's saying that you now need to get married to her But you had your first kiss and it was wet and that's great It was moist He said wet I know, but come on Harry It was wet Harry. That's the um Uh oh where is this happening? Oh! Jesus. Are the ministry? Or was he just dreaming it? Palantir! That's it. From uh, Lord of the Rings. Saruman's globe. In the dream, were you standing next to the victim? Or looking down at the scene? That was a thing. Professor, would he please just tell me what's happened? Never out. Arthur's on guard duty tonight. Tell him what's going on already! He's the one dreaming! Oh, thank goodness. Look at me! Exactly! What's happening? Take him seriously! What's to me? 
I don't think he's ever shouted like that. I'm afraid we can't wait. Not even till the morning. Otherwise, we'd all be vulnerable. Vulnerable to what? Aware of this connection is for the moment unclear. Pray he remains ignorant. Wait, what are you gonna do to him? Stick it up his nose? Take his brain out. Only when he had them literally begging for death would he finally kill them. But what are you gonna do just the now? The power of our clemency will help shield you from access or influence. There you go. Prepare yourself. Can I take my top off first? I'm sweaty. Wait, 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 If you could see that the Dementors were there by going into his brain box, could they not have just done that in the courtroom? Or could they not have just used the truth serum in the f courtroom to make sure he was telling the truth? They had decided the truth, that's the point. But you think with all the magic and wizardry and stuff, it would come down to a bit more than, oh, what do you guys say, Jack? He's guilty or nah? Uh, not guilty. No, not guilty. <laughs> Should've been like 11 and a half or something. No, Santa was that small. I did all the moves. I'm glad you're okay, Arthur. Oh, that's a joke. Come on, open up. I want to see your faces. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's a jumper. It's a jacket this time. See, even as you get older, yay, clothes for Christmas, yay. Oh, oh there's mince pies. I love a mince wow. pie. So you send sort of peel box. Send me some mince, but actually. No, don't. Because if they come from America, who knows what they'll be like? Ah, I'll give it a go. I'll eat it anyway. To Mr. Harry Potter, without whom I would not be here. Oh. Toast to Harry. Cheers. Cheers. Harry. 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 Oh, that is delicious. Could have been drinking wine instead. I can't understand why you don't want to wear it, Ronald. Yes, Ronald. You look like a bloody idiot, that's why. Well, it looks like Harry survived his encounter, anyways. Harry Potter. The boy who stopped the Dark Lord. Mm hmm. If my poor mistress. Are Frisia! That's enough for your bile! <laughs> of course, Master. Creature lives to serve the noble house of Black. Bloody creature. I always imagine, like, if that's what the dog would be like if he could actually talk, what he'd say. Not to me, anyway. It's not a nice family tree. This is my parents' house. I offered it to Dumbledore as headquarters for the order. Couple of deaths on that wall, though. What's a family tree? But that's not a death. My deranged cousin. Andromeda. My parents with their pure blood mania. Oh, Sirius has been blacked out, what? My mother did that after I ran away. I was 16. You know what? She didn't deserve him. I was always welcome at the Potters. I see him so much in you, Harry. Could you not do like Wallius Repero? I, I just feel so angry all the time. Yeah, he went from like that sweet boy to look at me! You know, and it was like, we what all was... like, okay. Don't really blame you, to be fair. What if I'm becoming bad? If you're born in Glasgow, you'd probably be a smackhead by now. <laughs> you're not a bad person. But people have good and bad sides. It just depends. You're supposed to have like 80 good and 20 bad. Roughly. <laughs> so, so your psychological well, yeah, assessment I'm not, of it. Yeah. I'm not We've all got both light and dark inside of us. See? 80, 20. What matters is the part we choose to act on. That's who we really are. Exactly. Sometimes I just want to wipe out a small village. And then I do it. And then don't let anyone know. Because <laughs> I'm a good right guy. <laughs> I like Sidious's jacket. A little bit of red velvet there. Smoking jacket in it. Yeah. Ah, oh, mate. Wallpaper over that room. It's a bit stupid. Especially if they'd blacked out my name, I'd burn the entire wall. Of course you would. I like burning things. So why this house is made out of 100% asbestos. <laughs> Look at that! Well, you're not allowed to go and see Hagrid because because there's a, a law against seeing Hagrids. Was there? No. Oh, I'm sure there will be after this. Yeah, then. there will be. Are you sure it's him or is it just someone burning stuff? Just you setting fire to this. 
I'm ordering Come. you to tell me where you've been. Oh. Your health. Yeah. Bit of fresh air, you know. <laughs> if I were you, I shouldn't get too used to being back. In fact, I mightn't bother unpacking at all. All right. But you've literally been told that you can't chuck people off here. Oh, a pile of poo or something. That's Plus really good to do it. Listen, Hagrid's got his own musk. Dumbledore sent me to parley with the giants. Giants? Oh. You found them. Well, they're not nice that hard to find, it. to be perfectly honest. They're so big, see? <laughs> and the dog's like, you gonna eat that, or are you? <laughs> She's not for his black eye. Go on, you have it then, you dozy dog. <laughs> it's so day. raw though yeah no i wouldn't give raw like that why windy in here <laughs> it's changing out there just like last time so winds a change the fact that she thinks she can just chuck him off of all people i think secretly she's actually him uh-oh All right. Who the hell and where? Where the hell? Uh oh. Letting all the people out of it. What's it called again? Azkaban. That's the one. Although the breakout was engineered by a man with personal experience of escaping from Azkaban. Your son? Serious Black. I mean, your son, your son escaped. Oh, so that's his cousin that he said he didn't like. You know, they really give him a lot of credit for these things. To be able to do that much damage. Oh no. He's gonna get us all kills because he can't face the truth. Maybe Fudge is a... bad guy. What I'm really trying to say is that... I believe you. <laughs> I was just waiting on being like, that's nice. <laughs> Aye. Good, Jin. About time. Thanks for making me feel like an asshole, though, for so long. A Death Eater named Bellatrix Lestrange used the Cruciatus Curse on my parents. Uh oh. They never gave in. I'm quite proud to be their son. They did say that he probably had the worst. Yeah. His parents had the worst. Well, maybe you can kill her. That'd be nice. A powerful memory. The happiest you can remember. Allow it to fill you up. Keep trying, Seamus. Yeah, Seamus is there. Look. I mean, if I found out that my classmates got to actually use the magic, I'd be like, oh, I'm salty hearty. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic, Jenny. Well, how's you made a pony? Think of the happiest thing you can. Oh, that's a nutter. Oh, you got a dog, oh. look. Aww. I think your, yours would be a, a doggy. A doggy. What do you think mine would be? A duck. A duck, yes! It'd be no son! Uh oh. Uh -oh. Who's figured out a way to get in there? I don't think they figured out a way. I think they're trying to break the door then. You might want to leave. There's a bulldozer in the hallway. Oh, Nigel. Ah, the stupid blonde kid. That's who I'm putting my blame on. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Oh, no. They did. They'll have used the truth serum or something on her. Get them. What get do you mean, get them? As in, like, scurry, go get them. Scurry. Yeah, tick, tick, tick. No, Professor, he had nothing to do with it. It was me. Who's that guy? He looks like Weasley. Dornish, Shacklebolt, you will escort Dumbledore to Azkaban. Wait, why? Why is he taking the fall for this? You seem to be laboring under the delusion that I'm going to. What was the phrase? Come quietly. Oh. oh. I have no intention of going to Azkaban. Enough of this. Don't blame you. The Phoenix! See you later! <laughs> well, I suppose that leaves Hattie in the clear at least. 
But you can't deny Dumbledore's got style. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, you're coming after one of the most powerful wizards. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna go well. Jeez, is that poor wall? Someone should be spotting those ladders. Nah, they want him to fall. Someone should be pushing those ladders. Yeah. What's this new one? Oh, head oh, teacher. Oh, God. My skin is crawling. Taking down all the pictures. pictures. They're just making this the next prison. <laughs> That's brilliant. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Go back to Game of Thrones, buddy. See what happens. Oh, they can all get tortured. Look at this is like some Game of Thrones crap right here. And she's on the, the Iron Throne and they're in that room. I don't see how this is acceptable. I know Harry doesn't have parents, but surely the other kids' parents would be kicking off at them getting tortured? If I ever sat on the Iron Throne, which I did in London, yeah, I would have a cup of tea. We didn't have a cup of tea though. No. Well, we went to Warner Brothers. And we had Harry Potter stuff. We had uh, the wand props and everything. Yeah. Oh, yikes. She is not liked. Not her fault. Harry. Don't be a dick, Harry. Whoa! That was your first kiss! You never even asked her what happened. I know, imagine not hearing it out. Even Dumbledore didn't see this coming. Harry, if it's anyone's fault, it's ours. I bet Dumbledore did see it coming. Well, that's why he wasn't worried. Because I don't want to play anymore. All it does is make you care too much. The more you care, the more you have to lose. But sometimes it's better to have loved than never loved at all. To go it alone. Psst. <laughs> You'll never be alone with Hagrid. Never walk alone, Harry. That's what Liverpool said. Hagrid, why can't you just tell us? Sneaky. Oh. Dumbledore gone. I'll likely be getting the sack any day now. Oh, I got it. The giant. Bobby. Oh! Down here, you great buffoon. Was this your son or something? Like, what the hell? Oh. Oh, he's adorable! Except when he runs, don't run! Is he on a oh, rope? I couldn't just leave him because... Because he's my brother. Oh. It's completely harmless, just like I said. A little high-spirited is all. Well, you left him all this time. Oh, oh no. That's your new friend, Hermione. <laughs> oh, Ron, what do you think you're doing? <laughs> Can't get him. Put me down. Everyone listens to her. See when she gets stern. Oh, you're in trouble now, mate. Uh oh. Aww. Oh, Aww, they've been told off. Just needs a firm hand, is all. I think you've got an admirer. Oh. You just stay away from her, all right? Oh, shut up, Ron. Oh, no, it's cute, though. Ron's like, that's my girl. Oh. Oh, that's his way of saying I'm sorry. Make it go ping. <laughs> look at Ron, he's... How are you now <laughs> jealous of a giant, Ron? You will look after him, won't you? Oh, I'm the only family he's got. Like, why is he just, like... Is there not, like, a... a... A place that you could send? Feeling sentimental. <laughs> That's private. Nothing is private in your brain. Every memory he has access to is a weapon he can use against you. You won't last two seconds if he invades your mind. Yeah, he'll definitely just use his parents against him. I'm not weak! Then prove it. Control your emotions. Discipline your mind. I find it so difficult to hate him. <laughs> Can't I just hate can't him. hate him. Would be a bit weird having your teacher see all your intimate moments. Your kissy though. moments. Uh oh. Aww. Snape! Spilly armor! 
Oh, I never thought of him as the Ability. game bullied. Who wants to see me take off Snippy's trousers? Hey, that, that was wasn't nice. You shouldn't have done that, Harry. Your lessons are at an end. I did. Get out. That wasn't nice. Poor Snape. Snape's doing this to like... Protect you. Yeah, yeah, to protect you and to save you. And you just went straight into his because you got emotional. Like, that's not cool. Yeah, it's, it's not as bad as it seems. See? It's fading already. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Oh, piss off, you little whole bag. Like, you literally made that boy cry. Naughty children deserve to be punished. Just kill her. Just abracadabra. I've always felt our futures lay outside the world of academic achievement. Yeah, this is the problem. You keep threatening to expel the kids and eventually they'll be like... I don't care. There's a point in school. Oh, Jesus. This is like COVID. <laughs> The invigilator. Uh -oh. You can't talk middle of exams, honey. Something's coming. Hagrid, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, of course it's the twins. <laughs> I'm surprised Hermione's not like, THIS IS MY FUTURE! <laughs> you leave Hermione alone. Oh, we like her. <laughs> Although, see if I had worked my ass off for this, I'd, I would kind of be raging. It's the grand opening of our new shop! <laughs> 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 we gonna do with the mop? You're gonna add a new one, no fireworks. Oh no! This is like Lord of the Rings. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no! What a shame! It's a quick way to clean the wall. Yeah, all your decrees, no. Yeah, no test! Yay! We're not here to sit exams. We're here for wands and stuff. Hey, he likes it. Yay, Winnie! Yay! Woo! Look at he's like, yeah. <laughs> Go on, lay down. Uh-oh. Oh, he's having a moment. Oh, I will, but first you will fetch it for me. Oh no! Why was he there? Sirius said Voldemort was after something. Something he didn't have the last time, and it's in the Department of Mystery. Harry That's a prophecy. What if he's only hurting Sirius because he's trying to get to you? But what if he is? Well, you can't just let Sirius go. Hermione, he's the only family I've got left. Yeah, and that's why he's gone for him, though. What do we do? Assemble the army! But Umbridge has all the chimneys under surveillance. Not all of them. Oh, her own. Ron's like, yep. Crazy cat lady. That's the cleanest crazy cat lady, though. When are you going to get into your head? We're in this together. That you... Oh, shut up, Pen. You were going to Dumbledore, weren't you? No. <laughs> Jesus Lord! Excuse me? Have you brought the Veritas serum? I'm afraid you've used up all my stores interrogating students, the last of it on Miss Chen. Yeah, there you go, Harold. He's got Padfoot at the place where it's hidden. Padfoot? What is Padfoot? Where what is hidden? What is he talking about, Snape? None of your business, Catwoman. I have no idea. No idea. <laughs> He's only saying that. Yeah. He knows. As this is an issue of ministry security, you leave me with no alternative. She's got torture, isn't she? 
The Cruciatus curse sought to loosen your tongue. That's illegal. But Cornelius doesn't know, won't hurt him. Um. Well, if you won't tell her where it is, I will. Oh, what is? That's the point. Off the scent. Uh. Dumbledore's secret weapon. She's so smart, isn't she? Nice. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, bring her to the giant. And then be like, pick her up, and oh, he likes that. Just squish her. She is doing? a horrible woman. Mm. Oh. oh no! Hmm. Okay. Where is this weapon? It's gone for a walk. And it is possible is for weapons to do that. What was it trying to trick me? I mean, surely you would have brought all the other teenagers out there too. I really hate children. That's evident. Uh oh. I mean, there's these guys too, but that's not what we were thinking. They're also not very happy with the ministry at the moment. This is a ministry matter. Oh my god. Get bored, bitch! <laughs> Just clatter, right in the face. How dare you! Filthy half breed! Oh no! Oh. Yeah, because that's gonna work in your favour. I mean, oh they, attacked. they attacked her first, let's be honest. I will have order! Uh oh. Yay! Yes, you shall! Yeah, just leave her. <laughs> the point is, we do know who you are. It's, that's the problem. Oh, don't let him. Oh, oh he's like, no, don't hurt me. Tell them I mean no harm. I'm sorry, Professor. I must not lie. I must not tell lies. Yes. <laughs> Bye. Have a good time. Have a good time. <laughs> Thank you, Corp. Bloody Splinter. Hermione. Hermione, serious. He's, he's serious. <laughs> I, I, he's serious, we gotta go. <laughs> oh man, thank God for that. How'd you get away? Puking pastels. It wasn't pretty. I told him I was hungry, he wanted some sweets. These people need to stop eating random things. So, how are we getting to London? Look, it's not that I don't appreciate everything you've done, all of you. Oh, oh God up, sakes. So how are we going to get to London? Yay! Teamwork. Fly, of course. With the Nargles. I mean, you've got broomsticks too. I know, why not use the broomsticks? Why use the invisible, visible horses? Wait, so is everyone just flying on nothing? Then? I was gonna say, I'm like, so they, confused. what death did they see? Obviously, she saw her mum, but. Alright, well, let's just go with it, I guess. They still exist, so would they just be flying on nothing? Would they just be holding on to nothing? I would not be happy about this. Come I on, much prefer a broom. Yeah, I'd prefer a broom too. We'll be in London soon. Yeah. Christmas stuff. Technically, we'll have already been by the time this video comes out. True. It was great. Nice place. Get some good selfies in there. Just remember, this is one big trap. So, yeah. So these are all prophecies, then? Is that what they said this was? Oh, jeez. There's numbers in your brain, though, when you would sleep them. I'd love to be a bull and go straight through there. Could do with some Smash lights, it all. Yeah. Also, how do you get up to the top ones? Yep, just like they said, it wasn't real. He should be here. Yeah, but how long did it take you to get there? It's got your name on it. Oh. Dark Lord Harry Potter. Could someone else look at it instead of Harry then? Yeah, it might mess him up a wee bit. But I was thinking because of Voldemort can see in his brain. Yeah. Is that it? Neither can live while the other survives. Well, we're gonna have to kill him then. Uh oh. Death eater, death eater. 
uh, you've been practicing against these guys. Between dreams. It's Malfoy. And reality. Ah! Oh! Who knows how to play? Itchy, pretty, baby. Gosh, she really does look like a witch. Like, <laughs> not in like a bad way, but like she plays it so well. How's mom and dad? Better now they're about to be avenged. Oh. Now let's everybody just calm down. Let's not. How can you be calm when she killed? Up. She killed your parents. You dare speak his name. You filthy old blood! Surprise. It's just a name, like whatever. Oh, well, calm down. Got plenty of other things I could call him. How did all of them get into the ministry? Why, who's unable to kill you when you were just an infant? Because I'm a wizard. Don't you want to know the secret of your scar? Well, it's love. Everyone said it was love. Bottom in your hand, all you have to do Give to me. Yeah, no, you're the bad guy. Don't do that. Don't do that. That's Malfoy's head. Like, don't care to see what's on it. Like, don't care. I Think like of your they, friends! I like they've all got a different mask, like Slipknot. I guess I can wait a little longer. Now! Students! Oh! Ah, that training coming in handy! Get wrecked. Yikes. Just bring it. <laughs> <laughs> I know kung fu. Oh my god! Bloody nargles! Yeah, it's Queen. Oh, he's gone. Oh, are we mouth? God. So I was gonna get punched in the face. That's child abuse. Well done, Neville. She's so cute. <laughs> well done, Neville. Come on, Hermione. Hermione. <laughs> We all get stupefy. What? <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Having a disturbed moment, you know. Ouch. Hey, these could be important. Yeah, there's plenty of other ones. Right, we're kind of stuck in here. Oh. Can you not use that? You're murdering people. They're oh. gonna murder us otherwise. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> Time to go. Oh, they wouldn't all fall like. Oh, okay. <laughs> they wouldn't all fall like that. No, no, no. of course not. Dominoes. Guys, just use your magic on them. What? Oh, wrong door. <laughs> Levitate. I was lucky. Lucky he didn't smash his ball. It's got a last ball in existence. Nah, I'm sure there's at least one more. Just stuffed up inside somewhere. The voices. Can you tell what they're saying? Okay, I knew. I hear them too. What the hell is it? It's very tickly on my ear. <laughs> Please Wait. hurry. You can't see the weird undulating Get mass. Behind me. <laughs> Classic line. <laughs> <laughs> How can they turn themselves into smoke demons? No one else seems to be able to do that. Oh, they've taken all his friends. You give us the stone, we give you your friends. But we won't, actually. We'll just kill them. Oh, Jesus. You already did the number on him. You killed his family. Settle down. <laughs> Oh, here it comes. I'll make this simple for you, Potter. I already called it. What'd you call it? Give me the prophecy oh. now. For what's your friends? That's now. what I said was going to happen. Oh, yeah, that was, that was some great yeah. prophesizer there. <laughs> you could take Trelawney's job. Don't give it to her. He's going to give it to him. What else can he do? Hit him with do some damage with that. If they were in the room, why didn't they just take it themselves anyway? I couldn't find it. Ah. It's not gonna work for anyone but Harry. No? Get away from my godson. Oh! oh! <laughs> you just there punched he him! Has. Yeah. 
Oh, they can be white smoke. Oh, oh no. Well, no matter. Yeah. It's the Marvels. <laughs> You've done beautifully. Now let me take it from here. I mean, we he found this. a stone and then it got smashed. That's what he did. Oh, come on, Sirius! Look at the oh, jacket. Yeah, yeah. Pow, 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 pow. Yeah. See, so they they know kung fu. You see. Oh man, kung fu with a wand. I just got a remote. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if Hagrid's got an umbrella, you can have a remote. Oh. He called him James. I know. Oh. No, serious! Are we alright? Oh no. <gasps> Wait, what? But. She's murdered him. <laughs> oh, let Harry go after her. Let. Oh my god. <laughs> oh! Revenge is okay. I've got to mean it, Harry. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's trying to turn you to the dark side, Harry. She deserves to die. But why does he then have to become Voldemort? I mean, I'd, I'd, I'd kill her. Do it. Well then. Oh! oh the way it came through! Someone's not weak. Oh though. man! I wish of you to come here tonight, Tom. I was sick. Did you call him Tom? Mm -hmm. What was his name? Ah, oh, okay. Oh, she got away! Not remember, Chamber of Secrets, Tom Riddle. I forgot. Come on, Dumbly. Come on, Dumbly! Don't pay any attention to Harry just now. Go on, take him down! Oh, God. Oh, cool. What the hell? There's a giant snake! Oh, God. Just, I would try and help! Just... Yeah, Harry, you, you thought that you were f***ing <laughs> strong. <laughs> Look at that! It's like a Christmas decoration! It's like Naruto! Yeah, get Sit back. down! Oh my god, he's so freaking strong! Jesus Christ. Why are you so mad, bro? Oh, oh no. He got coal for Christmas. Oh no. Oh god. No! He's okay, he's okay. He's okay. Just got a bit sandblasted. It's all fine. Oh yeah, you better run, pussy. Paddy could have taken you. She's got the mother. Oh no. <coughs> but you didn't do it, you can't take him over. You, you've lost, old man. <gasps> but Snape, I thought Snape did his thing. Well, Snape tried, didn't he? <laughs> you got a fight, Harry? So weak. So it's like being constipated. Get him out! It isn't how you are like. It's how you are not. You're nothing like him. Literally nothing like him. Yeah, you've got a nose. And friends. He has followers. Look at your friends! Aww. See, love. I can't believe they killed off Sirius. <laughs> Maybe he'll get his name right by the end of it. 
serious. You're the weak one. And you'll never know love. Or friendship. And love makes the world go round. Yes! Push him out! There he goes, there he goes. Off to the bin. Ooh. And you will lose. We'll see him Leave him alone, you're just a bully and a child. You might want to bounce, mate. Oh, could it be that he's real? Idiot. He's back. Yes! Oh my god! Good for you! I'm trying to tell you that for a movie now. Oh my god! Can you change your headlines now? Vindicated. Can I just get like a full two hours of like pew 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 Dumbledore is back. Dumbledore is like so strong. Like holy. Maybe you should just stop getting these new Defense Against the Dark Arts teachers. Yeah, just leave it. Just give it to Snape. He's fine. He applied for it. Like Snape deserves it. He's the only one there other than the usuals that actually tried to help Paddy. Although he didn't exactly help much when she was about to use an illegal spell on him. Well, I had to go and figure stuff out. But he didn't do anything, though. Well, he might have told Dumbledore where he was. I don't know how you feel, Harry. Are you dying? Rude. I thought by distancing myself from you, you'd be less tempted, and therefore you might be more protected. Oh, Didn't work, though. Neither one can live while the other one survives. It means one of us is going to have to kill the other. No, that's not, that's not what it means. It means one of these have got to die. doesn't mean you need to be responsible. I care too much about you. Oh, Dumbledore. He's always cared about you. He's done so much to help you. Pictures are back. Did you notice that like three movies ago we swapped Dumbledore? Eh? It's a totally different actor. The what? <laughs> I think it was like, yeah, the third movie, I think. We really? Dumbledore. I think so, yeah. I thought you just grew up. <laughs> <laughs> Most of my possessions. Apparently people have been hiding them. That's awful. The Nargles. Nargles. I'm sorry about your godfather, Harry. Aww. My mum always said, the things we lose have a way of coming back to us in the end. I don't think your parents are coming back to you then. Oh. If not always in the way we expect. She is cute as a button. I think I'll just go have some pudding. <laughs> Girl after my own heart there. <laughs> That is a chunky owl. That's a chunker. God, that would be That owl is not sending many letters. <laughs> That's crazy. Other than the friends he has made along the way, he officially has no family left. Got Dumbledore. We've got one thing that Voldemort doesn't have. Friends. Each other. Something worth fighting for. Love. Friends. Owls. Pudding. Pudding. Can something bad happen to the blonde haired guy now? Your dad's a Oh you just know that like he's something. got he's gonna turn into a, a death eater as well, don't like, you? Like something has to happen there. Every movie I'm just like, come on, come on. Push him out of window. Nothing. Push him out of window. He's not even like the like Harry broke his arm and had his bones all turned to jelly. And he's not even had something like that. Nah. Oh Nonsense. man. Oh, serious. Oh, serious. You can't be serious. Can't be serious. Oh, rubbish. And they called him James just before and then he went... I know. Dead. Because he thought he was fighting alongside his dad. Now you got a bad dad, a bad dad, a bad It was just so, like... It was too quick. The death. Too quick. That's the way it works for magic. No, I understand that, but... Kind of makes you wonder, though, why any of them bother to do... Like, Expelliarmus! Stupefy! When you could just be like, I've a degree of death. Yeah, I'm a little bit like, major character. All you need is that one spell, death. Had the, no. Let me speak! Thank no. you. No, goodbye. <laughs> I personally felt like to have a character like that die, they should have had, he gets, pyong, goes to die, 
And then she kind of backs away, so she leaves the scene. And then there should have been a bit more. It just went to the music, and then he ran from it. He ran to her. And I feel like there just needed to be that kind of, like, little moment where even as the viewer, you could kind of process it. Because it went from, oh my god, to, oh yeah, we're back with Voldemort. It was as if the scene was just kind of like, meh, meh. You know? What do you mean? They had a full thing where it went quiet and he was like... <laughs> I know, but I just felt like I wanted a bit more from it. It's just my opinion. All right. It's not all going to be like five minute anime death monologues. It you needs know? to be. No, he died. I didn't even have time to shed a tear. So what happened? Look at, look at Cedric. What happened with Cedric? I've had a cadaver! And he died. Like that. I've had a cadaver. Yeah, I feel like that's actually a bit of a critique I'm having with the movies. People die. No, like people die, but there's not enough of like a... People die in Game of Thrones. A moment. Aye, but look at the way... You're just not getting what I'm saying. Whatever. No. You want you want, you want want them to hang on it for a wee bit? Just a little bit, yeah. The stuff was happening. I know. I just feel like the character kind of deserves that. It, it just didn't do a very good job of going into like a heart-wrenching moment because it took you out of it so quickly that I would have liked it to just be like a tiny bit longer. But I think because of the way they did it, where it was like he just kind of floated away and was gone, that is what kind of made it that they couldn't, because he was gone, mm. you know? And then it's like, right, now we're going I was strange, though, that, like, he died and then just floated away. Yeah. As opposed to dying. Like, why did he float away? Well, what was that thing that was in the middle? He kind of was standing in that thing. Was that the thing that they came through, though? I don't know. Maybe, maybe he didn't die. Maybe he just fell over and floated away. I don't remember what that was. Was it not only him and the blonde could see that, though? And no one else could see it? Yeah, maybe it's a super special magical door. Portal. I don't know. They could only see if you've seen someone die. Maybe. Yeah, there's something, there's something about the death that I'm not... Surely all of them saw Sirius die, though, so they'd be able to see the ponies now. Yeah. I'm just saying there's something not right about the death, as you say, when it came to Batman. Well, maybe he's dead, we didn't see He the kind of died, and then you had the moment, and then the crowd had the moment, and then everyone... There was this moment, and it felt like for Sirius, he was an even bigger character that should have had... Does that mean he's not dead, then? I don't know. Oh. I don't want to say things like that, because then people are like... No, Susie, he's he's dead and that's just the way they wrote it. But there was just something about it for me that was like, not sure about that. Mm. I'm not sure about it. It didn't come off as like, if that was him losing his god uncle, it would have been even more heart wrenching. His god uncle. His godfather. <laughs> Does that make sense? Like, do you see where I'm coming from? I thought it was quite, quite a heart wrenching moment myself. Yeah, it was sad, but it felt like... I don't know. Whatever. I feel like you're not... You feel like it was really quick, but it wasn't. Like, there was a full moment, like, after he died where... I guess it's because when when a big character dies, I guess you expect a scene to be over, and then they, like, come back to the body as that kind of, like, the dust is settled, but he's died, and he's there, and as you say, he just kind of floated away, so it was like... Yeah, but I also feel like it's easy to do that in, like, TV shows. Yeah. But not so much when you've got movies. Don't know. Overall, I really enjoyed that. It was nice to see um, Dumbledore getting his moment. Yeah, nice to see a, a, a good old magic fight. Ones at the ready. Like, not even just the magic fight, though. It's the fact that he is, like, the top, you know, of Hogwarts. And he just kind of looks like this old guy. And you think, oh, he's just the old guy in charge. And then it's like he comes out in this movie here and shows why he's in charge. And I liked that. Yeah, because it all says that D- um, Dumbledore was the only wizard that Voldemort was scared of. Mm-hmm. I showed you why. Yeah, like, whew, you know. Whew. Uh, it was nice as well that they Get finally... Get him under the collar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Old men, you know. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, and at the end, they finally saw he who shall not be named. Oh. Imagine being that vicious of a person that people are scared to say your name. Like, I get it with Susie all the time, to be it's honest. Me, to be honest. Susie Lou. Ah. That's why nobody calls me by my real name, because it's that terrifying. It's terrifying. Terrifying. But. Just in case I pop up out of the blue. 
They say my name and I'm like, hello! Yeah, the movies are definitely getting better. That one didn't stick to the the theme as much. I actually, talking about the woman as well. Dolores. Um, I like the way they wrote her. Because I hated her. Oh, yeah. God. Oh, man. She, like, her casting, her creepy smile, everything she did, I was like, I want to punch you so much. Like, I hate you. You know, so for her to get her comeuppance as well. Yeah, she's got sack. But the funny thing is, though, if you want to look at it from a different perspective, she was only doing her job. She was too much, but she was only doing her job because they thought the ministry... The ministry thought that he was like trying to take them down, sort of thing. So she was. Yeah, there. I know. Yeah, if you see it from their point of view. Yeah, it wasn't. Meant but she to was be... also like torturing children. Yeah, well, she didn't like kids. She said this, but she was, in theory, meant to only be there to make sure that that didn't happen. And then obviously she sees Hattie training everybody, and Dumbledore actually is like, "Oh yeah, yeah, that was totally me, Sue ya, kind of thing. Hmm. So. Everything that they thought was panning out in front of them. Yeah. I and guess. she was trying to stop it. But overall, being on the other side, she had. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it was a good movie. Was that, was that Susie? 8 out of 10? What did you... No, I don't rate it. I'm I don't not, like rating. I'm only kidding. Don't, don't make me rate movies. <laughs> the only movie I rate is Ice Age 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and they're all 10 out of 10. But not that. Late... What was the latest one that we tried to watch and it was absolute crap? That was not Ice Age. No, it was Ice Age. No, it wasn't. <laughs> but it was like done by a different company and everything. I don't remember what that was. But we're not talking about, we're not talking about <laughs> Harry Potter. 10 out of 10, watch Ice Age. It's a great Christmas movie. How so, is that a Christmas movie? Because it's got snow. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> All right, you guys. We will be back tomorrow with another Harry Potter. What is this one called? Half-Blood Prince. Half blood prince. I wonder if Voldemort will be in this one. Harry's a half blood. No, no, he's not. <laughs> Harry's Harry's mum was a. Uh, I don't know. Is he was was Harry's mum? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I'm just here for wizards and people and stuff. You're a wizard. Don't ask me any intricate details because they're way over my head. You're a wizard. All right, you guys, thank you so, so much for hanging out with us. We hope you dinner. enjoyed this. I'm hungry. He needs dinner. I can tell you're acting a bit weird. Because I'm a wizard. He gets to this stage of the evening where, like, I'm trying to speak to him and he's like, her, 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 and that usually means he's hungry. I'm going to cut you out of this episode. Do it. Let's see how that would look on camera. You'd have to really zoom into your face and... Yeah, just motion track my face around the screen. You know, you've been really horrible tonight. I'm like, not I'm, like, really me. I'm just so over you. Like, I just want to watch a nice movie and you're just here. It like... was a very nice movie. Someone died. Yeah, I know. Or maybe they didn't. <sighs> <laughs> this is what you all want. Just me. Just my content. Why is all going? Why is leaving? Bye. Oh, she's back. That was terrifying.